In this video, I'm going to show you how to route the Xperia Arc using a ginger break. This works on almost any Android phone running 2.3. Um, routing is optional and it allows you to do things like remove system applications that came with your phone as well as install applications that allow you to modify your phone uh, such as ad free or programs that take screenshots. Routing does not make the market free. Uh, you have to buy apps or find places to download them. Uh, to start off, you don't need a computer to do this. All you have to do is download uh, Gingerbreak. So I've created a short link in the description. It's jp1 slash gingerroot and when you, go to the, when you go there, it'll just download the file. So it's starting the download. And once the download is complete, just run the application. Do you want to install? Yes. Once you've installed the application, open it up. And this is Gingerbreak. So it installs um, super user as well as uh, root. So you, again, you have to have an SD card installed, and you have to have USB debugging enabled under application and development. On some phones, this will wipe your SD card, so make sure you have a backup. Hit OK, and then just click on root device. So once your phone has rebooted, it's going to take a while. If you go into your applications, uh, just wait for it to start up. Go into your apps. You'll now see super user. And that means your phone has been rooted. So now I'm going to test it by installing uh, BusyBox and AdFree. going into the market search and busy box Uh, BusyBox is required by certain other applications like Titanium uh, because it allows your phone to run uh, certain Linux commands. Uh, BusyBox is optional. The other application I'm going to install is AdFree. So add free. So once you've installed those applications, they should pop up. So when you go into Add Free, it should pop up a super user dialog, and that means your phone has been rooted successfully. So Add Free just blocks a whole bunch of servers that serve ads, um, so it'll save you time and uh, and data if you're visiting a lot of websites and stuff. But that's how you can check if your phone has been properly rooted, uh, running these applications that uh, ask for super user permission. And that's how you reach your phone.